Hey there everyone, welcome back to another episode of Ladder Up. Today we are in the 1400s for the first time that I can remember in a long time. I actually don't know if we've ever been in the 1400s. Maybe, I don't know, but you know, new season you take a loss, that's, well that's what happens to you. You get down in the 1400s and you just kind of stay there. So hopefully we will climb out. Um, maybe by next week I'll have a new team. I'm thinking that's the case. So we got Bob here, 6v6, double. Obviously, okay, obviously knows what he's doing because he's bringing the, the Cloister and the Superior. Holy cow. Um, Scarf Cloister is actually kind of a problem. Superior is also kind of a problem. Uh, Scarf Landris is a problem. Kangaskhan's a pain in the butt. Salamence is a pain in the butt. No, sorry, not Salamence. Uh, Blaziken. I'm thinking of using Salamence to counter those ones. Uh, I believe does... So the, really the question here is, does, does Mega Salamence outspeed Blaziken? At plus one, that's the real question. If it's a jolly, if it's an adamant Blaziken, or like modest or not speed boosting, then definitely no. Um, once one eighty nine Blaziken. I don't know here, cause I'm thinking about just going Salamence Sylveon and just kind of relying on that. I'm also considering going Trick Room. Which is one way to do it. Uh, 41 seconds. Okay, so... If it's Mega Blaziken... Then it... It will outspeed after a speed boost. It'll also outspeed after... Okay, so either way it's gonna... It's probably gonna outspeed. <sighs> Crap. Alright, um... But what can it do? Nothing, really. I might go... Tyranitar, as well. Now I'm going to do this. Uh, I want you, and I want you. Yeah, I need those. Because I need Conkeldur for the Cloister, and for the Kangaskhan, and also a little bit for the Landorus. And Mach, Punch, Mach Punch is good against Blaziken, too. It's also good against Raichu. Um, if he tries to... If he leads Raichu and... If the game goes to the battle, and he tries to paralyze... Like, if he leads Raichu, and I think he's going to try and paralyze uh, Salamence, I can just switch in Conk Helder, get a Guts Boost from the from a Nuzzle or whatever, and we'll be good to go. This lead puts on a lot of pressure on him. Raichu Landris. Okay. Okay, here's the beautiful thing about this. He's not Scarf Landris. Is that Air Balloon Raichu? I didn't see. If he switches out Landers here into something else, that's good for him. Um, I think here you want to protect... You can't just let him... Do I want to protect and Hyper Voice with Sylveon? What can he do to Sylveon, really? Not a whole lot. So he wants to fake out Salamence. I'm okay with that. I can't. You know, I'm. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna waste turn. He wants to fake out Sylveon. Fine. It'll take some damage, but I. If I can get a Hyper Voice off, do a ton of damage, and then I can round the next turn to knock both things out. I like that idea. Yeah, I've. I've gotten this bad habit of just always double protecting in the face of fake outs. He does have Nuzzle. Okay, so if Sylveon actually attacks here. And this is okay. Oh, not this crap. Sylveon's gonna flinch, of course. That's a crit? Of course it's a crit. Of course it's a crit. Why would it not be a crit? Oh my god, it's so annoying. Okay, but we're gonna knock out both things here. If Sylveon doesn't get paralyzed... If Sylveon doesn't get paralyzed, we're gonna knock out both things here. And that's, that's lovely. I just, yeah, I, I rounded into Landris, which should knock it out. I rounded into Raichu with Sylveon, which should knock it out. Which should be good. If. And only if. I could Hyper Voice, too. 
but it won't take out the Raichu. Superior. Oh, well, this is going to hurt. Okay, so that's going to do a, a decent amount of damage. I think half at least. Oh my god, it almost knocks it out. Sylveon, come on! Dude, this is such trash. Paralysis is such garbage. Like, this is absolute garbage. Okay, well here, I'm just going to Hyper Voice and switch in Heatran. Oh my god, I'm, I'm just... We would have been in such a good position if Sylveon had just attacked there. I, I'm sorry, I played that right. I don't care what you say, I played that right. You're going for a Hidden Power Ice. You get another crit. Dragon Pulse. I didn't know it got that. I honestly didn't know that it got that. Salamence. Mm. That, that. Ooh. 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 Ooh, I'm not angry. Oh, I'm not angry at all. God, that's so irritating. Oh my god, so irritating. That is truly irritating. This game would have been over if, if we hadn't got paralyzed. This guy's literally only in the game now because we got paralyzed. If we didn't gotten paralyzed either of those times, he's down to two mons. Well, thankfully, we Heat Wave, so those are gone. Is that Salt Vest Raichu? That Raichu better go down to burn. That's a Salt Vest Raichu. Oh, my God. I swear, Wolf, Wolf wins one, one little world championship with a Raichu, and now everyone wants to use a Salt Vest Raichu. Oh, man. So, now he's got Landorus. And if he has Kangaskhan, this is not great. I'm not sure what he and or she is waiting for, really. Because you've got a weakened Landorus, and then probably a Kangaskhan. Oh my god. Blaziken. That's going to be Mega Blaziken. That's going to be Mega Blaziken. I'm not going to be able to outspeed it. He's going to protect. He's going to protect an Earthquake. He's going to protect an Earthquake, probably. Um, I'm going to Hyper Voice here. Switch into my Paralyzed Salamence. Because it's not really doing me any good. I'd like to keep Heatran for at least a little bit longer. Everything being Paralyzed is not fun. If I can just knock out... Landorus, this is good, because then I can just I can mock punch the Blaziken. I don't have to worry about it that much. Oh, he just rock slides. Okay. So he didn't uh, do the thing I thought he was gonna do. Flare Blitz into Sylveon. Okay. Okay. Is it at least speed boost Blaziken? Okay. Let's say. Um, okay, so here's what I'm here's what I'm doing here. So if I put I send in a Heatran for this reason. If your earthquakes, if he want if he doesn't want to hurt knock out his own Blaziken, he has to protect it if he wants to earthquake. If he wants to earthquake to get rid of Heatran, Salamence is fine. I can hyper voice. If he wants to rock slide, I mean Heatran could probably live a low kick. So I mean this is. What? This is probably Mega Blaze. It should be Mega Blaziken, really. Um, do I want to get rid of the Landorus or the Blaziken? I I'll get rid of the Landorus. And then I'll Hyper Voice. Yeah. I think this makes sense to me. He, he low kicks. Okay. Is that... Wow. I guess just... I guess it's just, uh... Oh my god. Okay, so what can... Will a Mach Punch take out the Landorus? I don't know. 
He showed low kick and he showed flare blitz. I'm, well, I'm at least I'm at least glad I didn't bring Tyranitar to this. Let's find something out here. Nugget Bridge Damage Calc. How much does a Mach Punch do to Blaziken? That's the real question. Because if I if I can take it out after another life orb recoil. Oh sorry, it doesn't have life orb. What does it have? Yeah, it, it, it took Flare Blitz damage, not Life Orb damage. So that, that was just a lot of... Was it ex Expert Belt? I don't understand what's going on. My Mach Punch does 31%. So... I have to be able to... And then what about Landorus? What does Landorus take from... Uh, Landorus takes... Not that much for Mach Punch. Okay, um... I gotta get rid of this thing. Alright, I have to Ice Punch it. I mean, he, he might protect Blaziken for some reason. What is this crap? Thank goodness, at least for that. Okay, Blaziken. Plus two attack. Oh my god. Low kick. Uh, yeah, pretty much all it's everything it does is gonna knock me out. What why is why is the connection so bad? Even if it's Yeah, everything it does is gonna knock me out, so pretty much just have to mock punch. Mock Punch wouldn't even crit, would it? Nah, it wouldn't. That's, this is so dumb. I literally only lost that game because of those paralysis. Those two paralysis. Either one of those doesn't happen, I don't lose. This, this game is stupid. <laughs> and he gets a crit, just, just to add insult to injury. This is this is the week of bad luck. This is the week of bad luck. So even if I'd crit there and he would have knocked himself out to recoil, he still would have won because that's how the game determines the winner. If you if you not if it's like a double knockout or whatever, you both have zero and you knocked him out with by like recoil, whether it be flare blitz damage or life orb recoil, you still win. Um, yeah. So that sucked. Ah, uh, crap. Come on. We gotta do we gotta do better than this. This is this is just embarrassing, really. So um yeah, I think definitely thinking this team you know what, since we're in the bottom of the ladder, I wanna go ahead and switch to a different team. And we're gonna fiddle and fart around with that and see how it works. Cause yeah. So this this is this is it for ladder up, and I hope you enjoyed it. Because now that we're successfully in the fourteen hundreds, it's time to I guess not take it seriously. <laughs> So if you like it, feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And hopefully I will see you back for another episode of Ladder Up.